Hi, Code Geass anime fan here, and I'm a really big fan of Vincent Price, one of the greatest actors, at least of his generation, if not one of the greatest actors of all time. Uh, Vincent Price starred in a lot of movies, and a lot of them being horror, and I'm really not a horror person, really, but made some big exceptions for Vincent Price because he is that great. Of course, I know him as Egghead from Batman. Well, he's also Vincent Van Gogh in Scooby-Doo and uh, even worked for Tim Burton for a little bit. He is amazing. And so we have this toy of him because rightfully so, as they should make a toy of Vincent Price because he is that awesome. And uh, this was made this was a 2022 toy. So yes, even after all these years later, people still love Vincent Price enough to make this sort of stuff of him, and again, rightfully so, because he is that amazing. Part of the reflection, uh, not sorry, not reflection, reaction figures, um, meant to look kind of old school. Uh, it says here, adult collectible, not a toy. I mean, it's still technically a toy, but I know what they mean, not a toy in the traditional sense. A uh, Master of Mayhem action figure, it says here. A mild-mannered man turned horror icon. Yes, very excellent. Very, very good. But yes, yeah, so this is collectible. Been waiting to take it out of the package for a special occasion. And I always say, oh, well, if you take it out of the package, it's not as valuable, but what? expect me to sell Vincent Price? No, 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 not a toy Vincent Price. I mean, he's too priceless. I mean, it's it's Vincent. He is excellent. But yes, finally taking Vincent Price out of this package. And Vincent Price is not alone. He does have what I believe is Crow. He was in that movie, uh, The Crow. I don't know if that's what it's trying to reference, but we do have a little crow. But there we have the main attraction, the star himself, Vincent Price, looking very fancy and handsome as always. And it says not a toy, so it's maybe expect an articulation, but he can move his arms, and he can move his legs. So this whole not a toy business. It's tended to be a toy. I guess it's more of a collect. Again, it's a doll collectible, not a toy. No, no, it's a doll collectible and a toy, at least in my opinion. But yes, here we have it, Vincent Price. And I hear some of these reaction figures can be very expensive. Sometimes it's like what twenty dollars for these little things. So these these wouldn't be nor something I would normally collect at least at that price. Uh, I do think it was worth it, you know, if there's one that you're just absolutely want to have that you just, that just looks absolutely amazing, and if you have that money, then I think it would be worth it. So I think in this case, because it's Vincent Price, one of my favorite actors, and that's not, I don't think they normally make, yeah, I think, you know, maybe they make toys regularly, like, you know, maybe like sports figures or stuff like that. I don't think, like, Vincent Price, just not a character you play, like Vincent Price himself, that's something they would normally make a toy out of. So in this case, it was worth it, and it is amazing because, I mean, it's Vincent Price. It's Vincent Price in action figure form. I mean, there's no complaints there. I mean, great suit, great design, looks like him. It's amazing because Vincent Price is amazing.